Alicia Kuroda Metten and I'm currently a second year here at CSC. Over my time here I've seen the great and not so great moments of our school and truly think that we can make our school a better place. Earlier this year I was actually one of the MCs in the Stage 1 Awards Night and enjoyed it thoroughly and I'm keen to increase my involvement with the school. I strongly enjoy discussions with peers about important topics and can see so many opportunities for our school to grow. Such ideas include opening up more classes which our school currently doesn't have such as Greek or Spanish or Arabic, languages that you guys are interested in, or even women's studies. Another crucial area of development is increased teaching, awareness and equity of mental health, which is something I'm really passionate in, and the support available for us students. Personally, I struggled a lot with my mental health in Year 10, and although I tried to hide it, it negatively impacted my grades, and I ended up dealing with a lot of self-hate. But I've come such a long way since then, and really want to make sure others can feel as supported as I did. I really think we need to increase trust between us and our teachers and making sure all of us can get the help that we deserve. I would love to hear what you guys think we can do to actively improve our school, so please vote for me for school captain in 2022. Thank you. Why not? That question is what inspired this speech. My hope is for you to ask yourself the same question by the end of the day. As some of you here today may know, I've only been in this institution for about four to five months now. Basically, I'm the new kid on the block. I spent the last decade in Singapore, formerly my hometown, studying and doing my secondary education. I graduated around this time last year. During that period of being a fresh graduate, I spent my time in a French restaurant serving souffle in Bordeaux. Where am I going with this, you may ask? Well, during that time I spent serving souffle in Bordeaux, I would often reflect on my final years of high school. I think about the memories I had made, the bridges I had burned, the late nights spent trying to complete an assignment at 11.10, the gut-wrenching feeling of waiting for exam results because you're not too confident that you did well. The point is I've been there and I understand that the final years of high school are important and they'll leave a lasting memory. That being said, if I'm to become your school captain, I plan to set realistic goals. Goals that reflect on the core values that are weaved into the core of our school. I promise to do whatever I can to make 2022 in CSC a safe and open environment and make sure that when you reflect on your final year of high school, you actually miss it and might want to come back. Before I typed up my expression of interest to be part of the SLT, I didn't think about how well it would look on my resume. I thought about the responsibility that it would entail. Am I, I asked myself, am I really prepared to lead a school filled to the brim in a melting pot of people from various cultural backgrounds, religion, races, identities, preferences, and people who think pineapple shouldn't be on pizza. And I asked myself, why not? President John F. Kennedy once said, we chose to go to the moon in this decade and do other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we are willing to take. The challenge of being your school captain is one that I'm willing to accept. My objectives if I were to become school captain are simple. To create an environment that is encompassed by respect, trust, responsibility, and honesty with a high emphasis on high expectations for the coming year. Now, when the time comes for you to fill up your ballots and you see my name, I want you guys to ask yourself this question. Why not? My name is Caleb Ola Demeji Peter. You can call me Ola. Thank you for your time. Hi everyone. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Zoe McDowell and I'm a Year 11 Centre for Excellence student and I'm addressing you all today in the hopes of receiving the leadership role of College Captain for 2022. Um, I acknowledge that it is a privilege to take on this role, however I am certain that I am your ideal candidate. Um, I would like to start by mentioning that I am a caring, friendly and diligent student and I'm also someone who can promote the school's core values, honesty, respect, responsibility, trust and high expectations. 
when I was a first year student, I remember feeling really overwhelmed with the pressures of high school, worrying about completing my NTCET, ATAR, subject selections, and not really knowing who to talk to about issues or concerns that I might be having at school. But the big thing about high school is learning about yourself. Many of us will leave here with only a vague idea of what our future might hold. That's why CSE needs someone who can work with you to make your high school experience the best it can be. Um, I've had a lot of experience with school leadership roles in the past, as well as a number of sports captaincies, and through these responsibilities I've become familiar with listening to the opinions of other people and taking action upon them. Anyone that knows me will agree that I relate well to my students and teachers and I've had a lot of experience with leadership roles in the past at school and also through a number of sports captaincies and through these responsibilities I've become familiar with listening to the opinions of other people and taking action upon them. Anyone who knows me will agree that I relate really well to my teachers and other students around the school and I can always be relied on for help when needed. I am very passionate about the environment and my community and I have thought of several ideas of ways that I can improve CSC such as implementing recycling bins to reduce the school's waste as well as vending machines so that students and staff can get food when the canteen is closed. Furthermore, I believe that the canteen needs cheaper food options for students. Another idea that I've thought of is implementing a number of new enjoyable fundraisers to make school events such as graduation more affordable for us all. I'm willing to seek your opinions on issues such as these and I'm willing to work with you to make our learning environment the best it can be. I care about your interests, I care about your voice and I care about making opportunities available for everyone and I hope that you can feel comfortable approaching me as not only your school captain but as someone who you know will be proactive in improving your learning environment. Thank you for listening.